Skeletal muscles are responsible for the voluntary movement of the body. They are composed of fascicles containing multiple muscle fibers where each represents a single cell. Individual myofibers are covered by a basement membrane which is continuous with the endomycium connective tissue layer. Peeling away the basement membrane reveals myofibers and the skeletal muscle stem cells, also known as satellite cells, which play a critical role in muscle fiber repair. Peeling away the sarcolemma membrane of the myofiber reveals the intracellular components, including myonuclei, that originate from the fusion of hundreds of myoblasts. The myosin and actin contractile apparatus gives us the ability to move in a controlled manner. Minor trauma events are common in the human body. Following damage to the muscle fiber, nearby quiescent muscle stem cells are prompted to activate and dislodge from their niche. After cell division, the resulting daughter myoblasts differentiate, then fuse with the damaged myofiber and restore its integrity. A major trauma to the muscle can be induced by massive injury, including toxins such as a snake bite. Even after extensive damage, small groups of healthy cells can be found. Following necrosis of the muscle tissue, the remaining viable cells, including muscle stem cells, engage in the regeneration process. The satellite cells activate and generate daughter myoblasts that begin the process of rebuilding the destroyed muscle fibers. During this period, residual debris is removed by the macrophages. The new muscle fibers are generated within the collagen matrix of the pre-existing basement membranes, following the differentiation and fusion of hundreds of myoblasts. Notably, during this regeneration process, satellite cells will self-renew and they are then set aside for future repair events. A range of myopathies can trigger a state of chronic regeneration as myofibers continuously are damaged. As a result, stem cells are frequently mobilized to activate and to produce myoblasts that will repair the ongoing damage to the muscle fibers. Muscle stem cells are quiescent during homeostasis. Following a trauma event, the satellite cells activate, then divide to generate daughter myoblasts that differentiate and repair the damaged muscle fiber. A fraction of satellite cells will self-renew to maintain this stem cell pool. Sarcopenia is the progressive loss of skeletal muscle mass and strength during aging. This process is associated with a decline in the number of muscle stem cells. It is thought that during aging, satellite cells continue to activate, but that the self-renewal process is compromised, resulting in a reduction in the total number of satellite cells over time. This decline in stem cell number, as well as quality, contributes to the loss of muscle mass quality and strength during aging. 